Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome back to a, another final at the University of Nottingham. We're about to kick off with the girls' Sabre under 40 for the BRC event. On our left, we have Charlotte Franklin from Shakespeare Source, and on the right, Hannah Hughes from Turo. Final refereed by Louis Gosling. Start of the match with a nice freeze attack there from Hannah. Well, that was a nice attempt at a parry post from Hannah. What do you think let her down on that one? Slightly mistimed it, and Charlotte definitely wanted to make mm. that hit. Both girls quite determined fences, don't you think? Yeah, I think if someone's going to get hit, they're going to absolutely know about it from both sides. I wonder if that's one of the reasons why it's these two in the final. Just rushing there from Hannah, got caught by a counter-attack. Mm. We've all felt them. <laughs> and as someone who used to coach Hannah, I've definitely felt that one before, quite badly. <laughs> Yes, uh, she's not shy of taking up that middle. Another again, a bit unsure there from Charlotte. Hannah taking advantage of that. Yeah, her footwork really showing the distance of the difference at the moment. And again, an attack. We are going into the minute break with a lead for Hannah, 6-2. So what do you think each coach is going to be saying to their fencer at the moment? So I feel like Chris has uh, definitely got a bit more work to do there with Charlotte than James will have with Hannah. Probably saying to her not to let Hannah have that much control in the middle of the piece. Mm. What do you think is going on the other side? I think it would be a case of keep up the good work, keep the pressure on, but be aware that she's probably going to change and come at you a lot sharper. So she's going to have to need, she's going to have to be ready for that change in speed, change in timing. Uh, how she reacts to it, that's kind of up to her, but she does need to be aware of it. What are Charlotte's options here, do you feel? What changes could she make? Probably going to shorten up her preparations, if anything else, give herself a little bit more time to see and to act, rather than at the moment she's rushed into the middle. She's stopped so many times, and Hannah's taken advantage of it with strong attacks. I feel like Hannah definitely wants to hit, and Charlotte could take advantage of that, really, and try and sort of lead her into traps of attacking early. That's true. Hannah was born wanting to hit, but if uh, we can uh, get some movement going on from Charlotte... Start the second half, see what's going on. Again, we've seen a bit better footwork there from Hannah to pull Charlotte short. One light, but also had the priority as well. Attack on prep there. That one has been open. Oh, again, we see that attack now. Like Charlotte takes it up, but she doesn't really capitalise on her advantage and Hannah's able to be walk all over with that one. Yeah, she's very quick to notice that hesitation from Charlotte. She's choosing her moment really well. Just a little bit lazy on the attack there. Charlotte able to take advantage of the timing very nicely. Just a bit frightened of that make miss now maybe. Excellent on the defence from Hannah and a long attack as well. Definitely more work to be done on Charlotte's end for trying to slow that attack down to something a bit more manageable for her. Oh, and Hannah not caring about the parry from Charlotte on that one, coming through anyway. Definitely uh, the control is still Hannah's side. So sort I of feel like a bit like this match is happening to Charlotte. Mm. It's a commanding lead, and she can pull it back, but it's been an awful lot of hard work, and she probably needs to start now. And she does, to be fair. It's a nice change in timing, different rhythm with the footwork and preparations. A little bit scrappy. Just needs to be a bit more sure about when she's going for the hit yeah. there, Charlotte, because she is picking the middle up now. Pressure's on now. One more hit will take it for Hannah, and it does. There we go. Nice final attack there to finish. Both oh. girls have a hug. They know each other very well. They fence each other quite a lot on the circuit. A 
here. That's uh, that's us, guys, for another. And we'll be back. Final. We'll be back soon with the under twenty ladies saber. Yeah. See you guys soon.